Hi, this is Dr. David Ginsberg with another episode of Research That Matters TV. You don't need to be John McEnroe to feel the pain of tennis elbow. In fact, 95% of people who suffer from lateral epicondylitis, or tennis elbow, don't even play tennis. Lateral epicondylitis is an inflammation of the tendon that attaches to the lateral epicondyle of your elbow. It can result in pain and weakness in the wrist and elbow. Repetitive motion and an awkward positioning of your wrist often contribute to tennis elbow. So how can you fix it? Reducing inflammation around the tendon is an important first step. Additionally, reducing muscle spasms to improve blood flow, circulation, and to speed up recovery is also very important. After the pain is decreased, be sure to begin a combination of stretching and strengthening the muscles, supporting your elbow, shoulder, and neck. Having restricted motion in your neck can predispose you to tennis elbow. Our team will carefully examine your neck, shoulder, elbow, and wrist to make sure the motion is natural and free of restriction. Tennis elbow is unlikely to disappear on its own, but by taking a conservative approach, you'll be in the best possible position to find relief. Our team will help guide you through a complete plan of care to get your, you back in the game. Once you're feeling better, you may even want to pick up a tennis racket as a new sport. Talk to you next week with another episode of Research That Matters TV.